Welcome back to Pizza Tower. Is this place a franchise? Uh, yeah, I, I think it's a mom and pop store, judging from the uh, the picture at the at the lobby there. I mean, I don't like the fact that on the, you know, as soon as you walk in the door, you look down and it has a logo of the place you're in. Like, I already know I'm going to Pizza Tower. It's 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 it's, it's window dressing basically. It's 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 to it's it's, it's celebrate branding. It, this place is so overproduced. That is a great face. Well, now we're in Blood Sauce Dungeon. I remember this level. I didn't like it very much. Yeah, this this one's a little tough. This is this is uh, the the fourth level in the game, and uh, uh, as you can see by now, we can access the boss, and we don't even have to worry about this level and just go right to this floor's boss mm -hmm. if you want. But you know, we don't we don't have to do that because we're, we're gonna do everything here. We let's get tossed in the sauce and let's get it done. All right, we'll just do a regular run through first here, of course. What are the challenges for this one? Well, the challenges here we have a uh, very very hot sauce, mm -hmm. which is never touching the lava. Oh, which yeah, we're well luck. on our way to to, yeah. to solve because we did. Yeah. Uh, Eruption man, which is doing a two second super jump. Oh! There's a special shaft in here where we can do a two-second super jump. Wow! Okay. And the third one is don't get hit by any of these pizza cutters. So we're working on that one right now. So we're gonna do two run-throughs of this. We're gonna do our standard run-through where we uh, get all these secrets, like ones like the one seen here. This one's kind of tough to get because you gotta jump over there. There you go. Then we're gonna do a run-through where we don't get hit by any of those pizza cutters or hit any lava. Oh my. Well, good luck to you, man. Well, we can do it. I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty confident. I've got, yeah, I've got confidence, too, seeing as how we're watching it. I would love it if one time you threw me a curveball. And, you, and you're just like, oh, yeah, I didn't get all the challenges in here. Oops. <laughs> well, so, so far, so ah! good. I mean, uh, how long do you think it took me to get uh, these episodes, like, on average? On average? Yeah. Like, uh... like, like, like between, the three, between the three we've done right now, how long do you think each of them took me to get? Does every well, let's say uh, episode so far. Probably grand total. Grant? No, not grand total. Like, like uh, each. Just individually. Yes. Oh, okay. Um, like a, on average, I mean. Let's say probably about 20, 30 minutes. Um, Do, I well, mean, depending on your skill level. Well, they already are about 20, 30 minutes. I, I thought you meant each individual level. Uh, let's say... But like, each each episode, each, each, each thing. Each episode, okay. Yes. That's, uh, that's what I mean. Are we we're on... definitely talking an hour. Uh, a, a little under, actually. Nice. You'd be, you'd be surprised that uh, so far I've had to cut uh, v very little. And that's what I like to see. I like to see skilled players in Pizza Tower. It's fun. And also, the pace is just so quickly, you can just mash restart and get right back in there. I don't know, it's just, it's, it, there's it's just something addicting about seeing Pepino flail around like this. <laughs> so that way, that way, if you if you mess up at the very last second on a challenge and you gotta do the whole thing over again, you know, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. You know, that's one thing I wanted to ask you. So, seeing uh, a playthrough or two, or I should say first impressions, it wasn't a full playthrough. You know, I watched episode one of somebody else's Pizza Tower playthrough. <laughs> And then I decided to see, okay, well, I've seen a, a few people's initial reactions, and, you know, they're pretty samey, just being like, oh, look at the funny cartoon man Whoa, running around real fast. Yeah, well, fast. What really interested me is seeing extremely good players play this game. What well, do you think is, you got, is... Is that sauce or soup? Oh, I think I think that's, uh, that's both, because if you add a grilled cheese, you get a pizza. That's true. That's true. That's not true. I hate God. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I was, just, I was waiting for it. It's just like, no, you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to say yes to this. It's, it's bad. It's like, yeah, that does make it. No, that makes a hope. That makes a hobo pizza you tried to pedal at me. No way. No fucking way. It makes literally no sense. So, what do you think the the mass appeal of this game is from a viewing standpoint? I mean, it's a blast to play. It's it's the animation. It's the sheer tightness of gameplay. You know, like, you wouldn't believe the kind of stuff you'd be pulling off here. Here's our, here's our third secret, by the way. If you're going for a no, uh, no, uh, pizza cutter run, ah. this is not the secret to go into. Yeah, I'd, I'd avoid this one on that, on that playthrough, definitely, yeah. What do you think would be more fun to watch? Somebody's first reaction, or somebody who's really gosh dang good? Well, I think we got both here, don't we? 
We do. I'm I was going to bring that up. I'm not really gosh dang good. I mean, I, I don't I don't go for P ranks. S ranks take every, every you know. <laughs> You're doing better than me, mate. <laughs> that right there is a is like, okay, cool. But my point here is to show off the appeal and also to show where all the secrets and treasures and how to do all the, all the achievements because, yeah. you know. Uh-oh. How do you how do you do a P rank? Just do it. Where's all the secrets and treasures? Well, that's a little more complicated. Let's let's look into it. How do you get into Let's Play? Just do it. Just do it. I'm sorry to give such a oh, oh, here it oh is. yeah here okay. it is. This is the shaft that you want to super jump in. Hup, hup, and go and, and uh, make sure you go here. Wait, and up one, go! two, easy every time. Yeah. Yeah, this one took me a couple tries mainly just to get the pathing to go all the way up here. I kept getting hung up on stuff. Well, it's meant to be challenging, you know. I love it. That's, a, that's, that's part of the appeal. You yeah. know what? Surprisingly <laughs> challenging Pizza Man game here. I love it. But it's 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 like the right amount of challenge, though. Oh, indeed. Maybe it's because I, I choose my own challenge, really. You know, it's like, what, what, what do I consider a, com a completed pizza? You know, do I if if I put the pepperoni in there, am I am I done there? Do I sprinkle some uh, Parmesan cheese on there? Mm. Do I do I add some sausage? Do maybe I, a couple peppers here and there. Maybe, maybe a pepper. What well, kind of pepper? Red peppers, bell peppers, banana uh, peppers. I'm we got pepper. options. I'd be okay with banana peppers. That wouldn't be too bad. Do I want to have mushrooms? What kind of mushrooms? I so, really, uh, I, I, that's why I think the appeal is like: Do you just want to beat like beat the game, or do you want to get all the all the treasures? Do you want to get all S ranks? Do you want to get all the achievements? You know. Whatever kind of pizza you want, man. That's why pineapple is both an enemy and a topping. Have I ever told you the first time I ever tried a deluxe pizza? A deluxe pizza? Yes. Yeah. That's supreme. Supreme deluxe. Okay, it technically was a supreme, so never mind. There is no either or. To me, a deluxe pizza is just a, you know, a 25 inch pizza. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, so so it was a uh, a deluxe pizza. So it had peppers, it had mushrooms. That's a supreme pizza. Okay, what? No, whatever. That's not whatever. Look, I just eat it. Okay, I don't need to. I don't know the official terminology. Anyway, anyway your deluxe supreme pizza. Go. Deep lore of pizza. Come on. <laughs> I'm an extremely picky eater by nature, so uh, you, can, you can taunt at the door to get a little extra points. I do like that. It's like you're stepping all over Pizza Face. You're kind of making up for the lost points you're getting as as the time ticks down. Yeah. Anyway, go on. Yeah, being an extremely picky eater my entire life, and then in my 20s, decided, you know what, I'm gonna try this, 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 and that. Try everything once. Right. I finally tried this pizza with all these other toppings that I wouldn't normally order myself, and I was so hungry at the time I didn't even notice what was on it. I was like, just. Give me the crust with a bunch of toppings, I'll eat it. Just stopped, and I went... Oh, crap, I actually really do like this. Alright, why was I picky in the first place? Well, that's how, that's how I found eel, basically. Eel. Yummy. So, let me tell you about uh, me. You know, when it comes to pizza, I, I just like pepperoni, really. <laughs> like, like, you know, that's... I don't know. I've, I've always been pepperoni. That's just, that's just the, the epitome of a pepperoni... Of, of a pizza. Cheese and pepperoni, that's it. Get that pep on there. Call me old-fashioned. You can have your toppings, whatever. Like, what, what do you think about pineapple? It's like, yeah, I don't care about pineapple. People can put it on there, whatever. It's a topping. It's a, it's a topping, and people eat it, and there and enough people eat it that they have it at restaurants. Therefore, it is a topping. Mm -hmm. So get over it. <laughs> so one day, I decided to try mushrooms. Mm -hmm. I'm not, and I'm not really the you know, biggest mushroom guy either. You know, not a big beans guy. That's uh, that's that's just me. If, it, if I'm picky, that's just me. So. I decided to try mushrooms at Pizza Hut, and it was really good. Gotta find the right mushrooms. Because the mushrooms they had there, they looked like they were like kind of baked on there. Yeah. Like, you know, so they had like that char, and they were crispy, and oh, they added just the right amount of savory flavor with the pepperoni already on it. It just, it just enhanced the pizza. Oh, it was delicious. Oh yes. And so, I, uh, I went to uh, another pizza restaurant in town. With my newfound uh, love for pizza, uh -oh. and my newfound love for mushrooms, it's like, well then, I will take a pepperoni <coughs> and, and mushroom <laughs> pizza. Look at me finally joining the adulthood. <laughs> he said with look vigor. At me. Yeah, yes, oh yes. <laughs> look, look at me finally having a mature pizza taste. All right. <laughs> Probably awful. So, the difference between like sliced mushrooms that you get from like you know the deli. Oh no. And canned mushrooms? Oh! So this whole thing is oh! So this whole thing is absolutely covered with slimy <laughs> barely cooked <laughs> mushrooms. Oh, what the fuck? 
And, well, I haven't had mushroom on pizza ever since. Canned mushrooms? What kind of monster ended up doing that? It was Pizza Cottage. Ow! <laughs> Oh, I've, no. I've, had, I've had qualms with their pizza in the past. <laughs> I just don't like it because it's, it's grease. It it's is, all grease. It, it, that was part of the problem. It's so fucking gross. And they had slime on top of those. So, Ew! Uh, it, was, it, was, it was the most humbling pizza experience I've ever experienced. Uh, I'm just glad we finally got a, a wood fire pizza place close to us. Yeah. It's pretty good. Except for the one guy over did my pizza and it was basically charcoal when I got it. But besides that, it was great. Well, I mean, you gotta be prepared for a little bit of charcoal taste, but I, I get I get it. Sometimes it just doesn't work. See, I'm one of those pansies that when they say, well, how do you want your marshmallow roasted? I go, oh, barely. I just want a little color. You got right no now. fire! You ain't got no spice in your life! Yeah, sure, we'll go with that. <laughs> Even your retorts are bland and spiceless. <laughs> and barely any char on that. <laughs> no char! No char! <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Oh, come on! <laughs> Argue with me! No, 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 I'm just medium. Yeah, I'm actually more like a medium rare. You know, you have a fair point, actually. <laughs> actually, uh, I want to pose that in the comments. I'm not starting a war. I'm just genuinely curious. What's y'all's favorite pizza topic? Toss it out there, because we're playing pizza game. Might as well talk about pizza. Right. But so, uh, it's a certain kind of pe there's there's Texas pepperoni, of course. Oh yes, I want mine with some spices in it. The only real kind of pepperoni I think you can have is if the, is if the curls. Yeah, the cups. Mm -hmm. Cup pep. Oh! oh, I can also do when it's like diced up bacon. Dice diced pepperoni is good too. You know, I you know uh, I used to try to have bacon on my pizza. But between the bacon and the pepperoni, that's just grease tastic. Uh, 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 oh, my stomach. I can't fucking see. <laughs> you start to see pigs in your nightmares. <laughs> uh, they're, they're hunting me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry, <laughs> pigs. I didn't mean to go in the secret. I know. I was just thinking in my head Is this the right secret to go that, through? That, that was an absolute mistake. <laughs> You are making great headway. Let's see we're that getting, ending. We're, we're getting to the hardest part, though. Yep. We I, got uh, we got this, and we got the, this jump right here. Oh my God! It's it's such yeah, a tight do jump. That and do that. Yes. And basically, do that. Just do, <gasps> do the short. You can jump to make sure you get it. This one little last little thing right here. When you get get through this, and you're home free. The Pino's oh. idle animations are great. Come on, hurry up! Yeah, exactly. <laughs> He's gonna like he does have the courage to cover the camera. I'm gonna oh, fucking die if you don't go. All right. Okay. We're, we're at, all right. We made it. Woo! We made it. We're good. Yeah. Just, good. Don't, just don't jump in that lava. Okay. Oh. Okay. We're not home oh, yet. We, here we go. Good. That one ruins so many playthroughs. Yep. I I can bet. Ruined one of mine. Right at the end. Right at the end. Thanks, Gustavo. All right. Now we're home free. And let me see that home free. Oh my God! I just realized those are anchovies. Yep. Everything's a pizza topic. <laughs> <laughs> I like the education one. He got a promotion. Yeah. That's what I. That's what I contribute that to. We got two chef's tax. Chef's chef tasks. Chef tax? Oh my god! Is that if I own my own restaurant? That's why he's in debt. Mm. Oh no. Pepino, please. Good soup. All right, so he's got. I'm gonna call that soup. It's got, it's got the ladle. It's spilling out the side. It looks. It looks like soup. All right, let's change our clothes to blood red for killing a hundred enemies because we're monsters. Excellent. It's now time for the boss. The boss. This boss gave me some troubles. I'll give it that, but once you figure out the pattern, you understand it. This this boss was just another level of which I fell in love with this game. Here we go. It Here is time he is. for Pepino versus Pepperman. Oh, I love it. That that is a face. That's probably Ren and Stimpy esque. Now we're just getting into insanity. All right, he's gonna he, run over there and he does yeah. the Wario shoulder charge, which Pepino can do too. But Pepperman makes it look authentic. Wario, it's very predictable. And then he starts then, changing it up. And then he points up and then changes direction. And then he'll start throwing out his weird uh, art projects that he can take out as well. His and they'll start dropping from the top. Make sure you keep looking. Boing. If it's flashing red, that means it's gonna hurt. Watch out. So now he does the butt pound, uh, he, bounce. There we if go. he's flashing white, then that means that he's ready to be vulnerable. Like, here, you just do one of those. There is so much tech that you can do with these boss fights. The, the yeah. One, yeah, that's the hardest part. In order to get a P rank, 
Which is what you, we're doing. You cannot get hit by a boss. You have to do it without taking damage. No damage. Because if you take, like, what, four hits, it, like, trashes you. Yeah, it just goes, oh, that sucked. It's like, wow, D-Rang, why don't you try not getting hit, dumbass? <laughs> that's what D stands for. So that's, what we're, that's what we're gonna do here. All right, there, there you go. Can his art projects be beaten by Pepino, or does Pepperman have to beat him? Uh, if they're flashing red, he can't touch them. Can't touch them, okay. Yeah, I hate the amount I, of art projects I that think, show up. I think you can parry them, though. Oh, that's cool. Now, for this one, you have to destroy this piece of artwork, and he's like, hey, real hey. nice, then you punch ah! him. Punch him in the face! Oh! I saw you, okay! And... Skadoosha! Phase two! And now, this was, this where I was like, oh shit, are they serious? Yep. I had to get through the first phase, you know, hard enough, and they tell me there's, a, there's an entire second phase where he, he has an entire new health bar, and his his, his attacks are doubled? Yep, he's faster he's, now. He's faster, there's more stuff! It's crazy! I love this. It's so frantic, and it makes... It's perfect for Pizza Tower. And what, they've also, like, animated more stuff in the background, so your eyes have more to focus on. Th that's, that's, what, that's what makes it yeah, harder! That's what kills me, is most of the time I'm just like, I just want to watch the level, it looks every, cool. Every boss does this! <laughs> every boss has the, has the, uh, the difficult first phase, and then they have, they have the, the same thing uh, again in the second phase! The every boss does this! The statues are harder to chisel in the second phase, too. This one's really tough because it's like right over there, but if you position yourself the right way, you can do it just fine. Uh, oh, this know, sucks! Out, out. Just, yeah, the artwork don't getting be greedy, in the way. Don't be greedy, don't be greedy! And... Gotcha! And then he's got one more desperate attack. He's gonna try to jump to the this. side. And I hate this. I hate this. I fell for this the first time. Dead, would you kill get the pepper man? Get him! Get him. Yes! yes! Oh, up Woo! here! Up here! That is a P rank for yeah! Pepper Man. Yeah! And now for a special uh, animation for getting a P rank. I love it. There's a key to the next floor, and I've never seen this in my own playthrough. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> And everyone's like, whoa! I am the pizza man! Henshin a pepperoni, baby. <laughs> oh, uh, that was a beautiful playthrough of Pepper Man. Good job. Oh, I love this game. It's so good. And we got a lovely pea there to top it off. Yeah. All the achievements. Good. Except for the S and P's, but we didn't even worry about that. It's all right. It's all right. All right, looking good, looking good. And I think we're all clear. There's uh, one more thing, though. What you got? You were telling me about these! I know nothing about these extra secrets! What is this? There are a lot of hidden rooms around here where they have a lot of, like, beta sprites. <gasps> Stuff from older versions, because uh, this game's been in development for, like, for like five years or that's something. That's so cool! Oh, wait. There's, there's a whole bunch of secret little bonus places around here. If you hurt Pepino too much, you can go to hell. Oh. You can go to hell, lady. Alright, well. Alright, let's get to the next floor. Love it. This is the thing I was most excited about, is showing off the secret stuff that I can't find. <laughs> and also just seeing all the stages. Howdy! Welcome to Floor 2 in the Western District. Oh boy. Wild Wild West. Oh yeah. It's about to get a whole lot harder and a whole lot trickier and a, well, a whole lot more fun. <laughs> Next time on Pizza Tower! What? <laughs>